when they first started seeing each other, middle school, by the way, Mallory comes home, and I guess she'd already talked to her mom about this. And, uh, <laughs> and Mallory says that her and Noah wanted to go out. And I said, well, no problem. Like, where do you want me to take you? Like, you want to go to the movies or to the, get some ice cream or... You're in middle school, for gosh sakes. And she looks at her mom, and her mom says, No, Dad, that's not what that means. And I was like, What does it mean? Well, like, they want to, like, go together. Oh. Um. Okay. Joseph Noah Rogers, your name has been a sweet sound to me for more than eight years now. From the awkward middle school memories in the band hall to the more recent, beautiful, raw, and vulnerable moments we've experienced, you've been a consistent source of joy, laughter, adventure, grace, and compassion. For Mallory, I don't even have to tell you how much and how long we've been looking forward to this day. And look now, here we are. We've dated for more than a third of our lives, and after nine and a half years, I'm more in love with you than I ever thought I could be. Joseph Noah, this I believe, that you are worthy of all my attention, affirmation, trust, sacrifice, and respect. That second only to my salvation, you are the sweetest, most undeserved gift from the Lord. Because these are true, for these things I will fight, to draw near to you at every moment and in every season, to love deeply, show affection, and listen to stay with you no matter the circumstance. Because these are true, for these things I will fight. To trust and support you as the leader of our family, just as the church submits in faith and reverence to Jesus. To establish joy as a banner over our household, transcending all circumstances. To pursue you like Jesus has pursued us. To know you more each day. To never leave you, forsake you. And to love you unconditionally because in Christ's secure embrace, love is never a risk. Mallory Grace, take you to be my wedded wife. Joseph Noah, I take you to be my wedded husband. Noah and Mallory have given themselves to each other by sacred vows and by the exchanging of rings. And so it's with great joy and honor that I get to pronounce them husband and wife. <laughs> Noah, would you like to draw this out? <laughs> Noah, please kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm proud to present to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Joseph Miller Rogers. There is no one else I would rather love, respect, and empower for the rest of my life. I consider it the highest honor to become your wife today and to stand by your side for the rest of our lives. May we cherish these moments marking the beginning of our covenant. And may we never lose sight of the faithfulness of our God, which has led us to this point and which will lead us beyond this moment. I love you with all of my heart, now and forever. 